How's it, everybody? Welcome to the Hawaii Rhino Fishing Show. Follow everybody for tuning in. We're just going to make it short this week, the intro, because I'm working on two vids right now. This one, which I hope to get out by Thursday. And I got a second one. It's a special edition. It's about giving back to the vid. This was on late sesh. We got to the spot when it was dark fall already. Normally, we like to try to get there early so we can set up, see how the terrain is, see where we're going to drop our lines. But this one, we kind of familiar with the spot. So we just didn't head out. Me and Fish Dropper. Check it out. Okay. Night sesh. Here we go. Oh, didn't. Somebody on kind lost their pants over here. To the trail, to the trail of tears. Whoop, whoop. Oh, that was easy. Secret spot survival kit, bag shrimp chips right there. <laughs> okay, sorry about. <laughs> this dropper is scared of Obakis. You can't just make up lies about people. Are you in a fucking military drone? Don't be jealous, my light bigger than yours, bro. <laughs> bigger and better and okay, stronger. Okay, bro, let's say a prayer that nobody's in our spot. That's the fucking spot. <laughs> yeah, that's true, right? This is true, this is true. But you know the spot, bruh. What is that? Kind of creepy. What? <laughs> you fucker. Creepy, I can deal with. I don't can deal with because no spot. Please. Nobody in a spot. Oahu kind problems. Nobody in a spot, please. Today is a Friday, bro. Today is a Friday, just saying. Bro, doesn't look like anybody's there, bro. Yeah, not yet. We, we gotta wait, but right now, wait, lights off. Gotta do the light test. I don't see anything. Nobody's there. Okay. Let's get this okay. Take a break, skis. Okay. Oh, nine, one, one, now. <laughs> oh so I'm gonna get on red light over there. Okay. That go way down. He's by the point. Yeah, so anywhere over here. Right? <laughs> anywhere? anywhere? Low tide, bro. You you set up where you like and then I'll either go right or left of you. No matter. I was just gonna go right here, bro. Yeah, I'm okay. checking. Let me check the tide chart. Going, bro. Bro, we're almost exactly on the low tide. Oh. Low tide is seven, seven twenty-one. The lowest tide. We're at seven nineteen. Oh. <laughs> so we caught this fucker on the ultra low tide. So the third tide is it's starting to come up. Yep. Yep. That's it. Yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna set up. You gonna set up over here. I'm gonna set up to the right. Woo, here comes the cold pot. Gotta get wet, guys. Gotta get wet. No guts, no glory. Ah. Boom. Bring that back. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Ah. Full moon right there, guys. Okay, that might be something now. That look like something now. Come on. Getting some tugs here. Spider ba. There's a bike. Come on. Come on. Don't play with your food. Come on. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna pull you off. Oh yeah. I'm just gonna pull you off. Okay, taking this guy off the rack. I'm gonna wait, feel for the bite, and then boost them. Oh, off. Oh, no. Okay, here we go. Fish on. Yes. Ah, 
kill you, bro. What are you? <sighs> so stoked to get one bite that early. We was not even maybe about half hour after dropping a line in. Normally it takes a little bit longer to get that first hanapa. <sighs> what are you? <sighs> Let me guess, 12. Lily! Oh! First one of the night, brother! Oh, brother. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> you f***er! <laughs> oh, Nenu, brother! Let's go! Okay. Okay, Nenu time, guys. There it is. And with the float. Alright, bada. Okay. Oh, oh. Ah! Oh, okay. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Ah. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Take okay, my son Inoue. Good fight, bro. Send you back. Whoop. And he's gone. Yeah, him. Damn. Looking for some live bait to throw out. Damn. Oh, one hand. Oh, got you, bro. Got you, bro. Let's see. Now, is he Amo Amo or is he Wowo? Get restrictions on certain kind of mullets. Um. Oh, shoot. That could be Ama Ama. That could, we might have to throw him. We might have to throw him back. So for more. But there's one, there's more. <gasps> right there. Oh my god. Right there. Okay, there him. Where'd you go, bro? Shit. Ah. Uh, small, small. Small. We need slightly bigger. Maybe some got trapped in these typhoons over here. What is that? Ama crab? Is that an ama crab or that's some ghost crab? That's an ama crab. I don't know what the f you are doing with all your spittle. Okay, let's put you in a net for now. Uh, we're gonna throw you out later. Sorry, my power attack light so bright. Couldn't even really see the crab down. Okay, just hold the net like this. Okay, hold them like this and then we can look for more action. Come back down and see bubbles over here. What the f is these bubbles? I feel like over here I'm gonna run into action. I still got that armor crab, okay. Bro, we don't wanna leave, leave our fish dropper alone too long over there, bro. Start getting spooked. I'm so fucking scared right now, you oh, shut up! Yeah, him. You see him, you see him, guys. Oh, what the f Oh, that's the crab. The fucking crab got out. God damn it. You f Okay. Yeah, that was dumb. All right, I'll let you go. I can get one, not a crab. You puck any shit, crab. God. And now I lost the mullet too because of that mutt. What, bites? Yeah. yeah. Oh. Shit. Yeah. Okay, one brother requested to see how I do my double hook rig. Here it is. First, thread the line to the front of the hook eye, pull off a good amount, and then I start my snail. So there's a little loop where my thumb and forefinger are holding down while I wrap the line very carefully making sure that the line doesn't go backwards on the wrap bigger hooks I try wrap them at least seven to ten times around or to the top of the hook eye once it's wrapped you want to pinch the wrap with your left hand and then thread right back through that loop with the right hand and then pull and clinch it down really important to pull it hard both sides okay once it's cinched down tight it should look like this one hook down, 
and we're getting a second hook right here for the second hook same deal you want to thread it through the front of the hook eye and you're going to pull it close to the first hook now this is really important the spacing between the two hooks is going to depend on what you're doing if you're using live bait or if you're using like on whole fish or puhi or like on long taco leg um, you can space these guys out apart accordingly for this double hook rig right here i was thinking i might throw out half one puhi so i wanted the hooks to be about maybe four inches apart eye to eye what you want to do is you want to pull it close and as you can see when you cinch down the knot it's going to spread out further apart so this is a little bit further apart than i wanted but she go okay that's what she should look like right there don't forget to cut the tag end off and always no make opala i cut it on me into my cart there you heard that because it's going ding ding and i heard ding 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 yeah watch them bro i heard three consecutive dings bro while fish dropper is getting bites on his poles i'm tying a simple surgeon's knot on the swivel end cut the tag in and we good to go the bites went slow down in that spot so i move one little bit further down oh hell is that what i think it is oh is this spot okay or what oh bro i hope you're okay hawaiian okay bro we're not gonna disturb you bro do you think i think brother is yeah oh okay you know what this is the time i i i want to say this is um the season where they the time where they lay the eggs and stuff but damn bro okay well this is their freaking place bro this is their beach i'm just a guest here bro no way bro we're gonna stay away from you guys bro ah. Roger. yeah Gone, you tying up the bait? Yeah, I'm starting to wrap them, but still, bro, it's like this one. After I wrapped it, yeah, and I made the bait even smaller. Yeah. Wow, this one was like. Bah, 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 bah. I thought I had, thought I had something on it. Yeah. And I felt it, and then it came off after you know oh. the reel. I don't know what it is though. <laughs> oh, bro. Okay. I mean, look at it deep. I don't think Hulu's bite at night, right? No, I don't think so either. I don't know, but interesting. Well, I was going to. Well, it sounded like you had actually. I was going to. Oh, right there, bro. Right there. Let's go. Let's go, bro. Something's on there. Come on. See, that's what they do. But God dang, bro. Right there, bro. See, that's what bro, you should try set them, bro. Just wait for that when you feel them and set them okay bro look you can see the vibration dude yeah. i would i would unhook them and just hold it and when you feel the fuck tugging bro just just set that fuck up yeah 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 what huh no too late he tried to settle Yay, nay. Shit. Bait gone. Oh, bruh. I don't know, bruh. Okay. Well, I was going to tell you, if the bite slows down, bruh, you can, you can bring that far pole, you know, in closer if you want. That way, you know what I mean? It's Because I get mines, I try them to the right. Both of them, I try them way to the right. Yeah, so, you know, if you want, if the far one, if you're not getting any bites, bring them. That way you ain't got to f***ing, like, strain your ears to hear. You're getting bites on everything, but it's like, you're not fucking looking out. Ah. Uh, yeah, yeah, Roger. Hmm? A few moments later. Let's go, you f***er. He's on, bro. Come go on, f*** on. around. Excuse the language, bro. Come on, let's go. Right here. 
Okay, here we go. Fish drop in action. How's it, bro? You feel them? You feel them big? Good size. Good. What the fuck am I stepping on? Right there. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, I better get the glove ready. Better get the glove ready for this one. What we got? Ninui! Oh, bro, there we go. Oh, oh. That was yours. Oh, bro, it's on dozer, bro. Oh, wow. This is on freaking dozer, bro. Oh. Okay. Yeah, oh, sorry. Yes, sir. In the face, yeah, try not to. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we got that finger right there. Fish drop uh, here. Hold them up. Hold them the kind, and then the kind. I can what? get. Uh, yeah. What? Yeah. Hold them up next to you, so I can get that fucking shot. Get that shot right there. Hee -hee. Look at the fucking camera. Not the fish, you fucker. Okay, fish. Turn, turn to the side, fish, you fucker. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, him, bro. Yeah, him is. Okay, okay. All right. Oh yeah, bro. That's what. That's what's out there, bro. That's what it is. Yes, sir. Good job, bro. Good yes, job. Sir. Good Thank job. You. Call me some. Yes. Sir. All right. This dropper on the board. All right. And you get to go free, so we can fight you again, brother. Huh? <laughs> huh? Okay. Okay. Go in, brother. Yeah, and there he goes. Come on. Come on, revive. Revive in the bubbles, brother. Yeah, he'd be good. He'd be good. Come on. Come on, let's go. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Come on. Oh, the is slack. Let me try to pull. Ah, okay. We'll let it go. Let it go a little while. 20 minutes later. <laughs> bro, right there, bro. Fish dropper was 9 9. <laughs> <laughs> right there, bro. It's slack, bro. It's slack. Right there, bro. He's a bro. He's on, bro. This freaking grandpa over here. Look him. Bro, take that pole out of the sand spike, you freaker. Bro, no fuck around, bro. Look, 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 bro. Look, bro. I'm telling you, bro. Set that fucking hook, bro. Not even my pole, and I getting pissed. <laughs> bro, right? Bro, you crazy, bro? You crazy, bro? I'd have that fuck in my hand, and I, once I feel that talk, bro, I'm yanking that. Fuck to the sky. <laughs> I'm gonna yank that fucker so hard he gonna flip on shore, bro. No need even fucking reel him in. Wow, you bullshitting. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, bro. Wait for that. Oh, right there, right there. Fish on. Bang! Told you. Fish on. Yes, sir. Let's go. Always check the time. Take notes. Let's go, let's go. What we got? What do we have here? An invasive? Is it invasive? Yeah! Taape, bro. On, on oh. those are taape. 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 Oh. See? Yeah, see? Okay. <laughs> you like, oh, oh yeah, whatever. Oh, this going swap. See, bro, I told you he was on, bro. Okay. Um, yeah, drop the line, drop him to the ground. I get my kind. Yeah, he swallow. He swallows. Ew. <laughs> yeah, bro. Right on, guys. Yes, sir. That's it. That's it. Okay, all the way to the sand, bro. Yeah, on the sand. Let's see if I can salvage your rig over here. Look at that. The beat's still on. Okay, cousin Lulu. Which way is the hook, though? I don't know. Just gotta guess with this one. Holy moly. Oh, Trying to fucking let me get the. Okay. 
Now I can see the fruit. No, I think I got the right way. Yep. Sweet. Thank you, sir. Oh, 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 shit. Just a good kind strike. Ooh. Right there, they've got stuck. Oh no. Oh. Lead line broke, fight back on. What the fuck is this? Right at this point, GoPro battery dies. Fought this guy for a few more seconds, but then he went bust off to lose money. Okay, new rig up, wrapping the bait with the nylon fishing string. Here you go, ba, to a fucking action packed night, baby! Fuck oh, yeah! That's it, back back in the motherland. Five minutes later. Here we go! <laughs> Drop the fuck out! Come on! Let's go! See, this is what I'm talking about right here. He on, he on! Do it! He's gotta be on, bro. Uh, oh, yeah. Yes! Fight him, bro! Fight him! What we got? What we got? Menui? Oh, what matter? Oh, my head lamp is fing hacking up here. Oh yeah, never mind. Never mind the headlamp. Okay, drop him to the ground. Oh! <laughs> right, he <do> <laughs> Oh! The fish dropper dropped itself! <laughs> nice one, bro! <laughs> one more up! They know he gets his revenge. Oh. I never bro. drop them, I never drop them. You never drop them, that bro, that f***er just <laughs> threw some sand in my face. You bastard. Yee -hee. Yes. Nice one, bro. Ah, yes. oh, oh, oh. Bro, love that, I love that. Whew. Bro, there you go, your bell out over there. Oh, shit. Little bit after that action, after we was all tired, started to fall asleep, and all of a sudden something hit one of my poles and a bell went off and scared the crap out of both of us. I don't <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god! Bro, <laughs> that, what was that? <laughs> that, that was, you know what, this thing doesn't. It, it, oh, it, the bell. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> oh my god. Oh my fing, my ab is sore, bro. Oh. Oh, that was classic, bro. Bro, don't tell me you didn't jump. Yeah, I did, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. I didn't, bro. Not tonight. I never. Because I came from the gym and stuff. So, I didn't. Wasn't in my no, normal. If I hit it in the morning, bro, I bring the tea leaf always. It's kind of eerie out there cloud just passes over bro then it gets all dark and shit Fucking wind is relentless oh, oh shit dude right there let's go bro let's go let's go let's go let's go right there bro come on hurry up bro hurry up the fucking gets slack reel it drop the fucking bell Let's go! Fucking really, bro! What Need happened? someone to change on, my bro. diaper. Is it on? No! Oh, <laughs> you f***er! Drop that bell and reel that f***er! Ay, Kurish. Oh, bro! That's too lost. <laughs> bro!
Bro, you know what? You f next time, just <laughs> reel it with the bell on. Oh my god, bro, this f fumbling with the bell. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. Stop it, you bro. see this f right here? Okay. Left, you see him right there? <laughs> Did you see that pole, bro? That pole was going for like half hour. And this f was fumbling with his bell. Reel him with the bell. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Let's go, let's go, man. Let's go. Okay, come on. I just need something to bite mine so I can show you how it's done. <laughs> You're making me laugh. <laughs> oh my god. Which one are you? Which one? Oh no! We suck again! Fucking one hit one though. Come on! Oh what? Fish! Fish on! That is fucking Huh? Oh. Turtle? Oh, hell no. Turtle? No, not like time. How's it feel? Heavy? Yeah, bro. Head turns? No. Oh, the fucking bird over there. What is going to the left? Let's see. What the hell, bro? Stingray? I, don't, I never see anything come up yet. Bro, please don't be on turtle, please. Huh? Yeah, hard to, hard to tell in this. Oh, it's taking it out. I haven't seen anything yet, bro. Unless I'm not looking in the right place. You see it, turtle. Huh? Shat! No! Oh, here we go. Big Oh! Oh! Couple months back, my boy Silly goes fishing, caught one stingray real close to over here. Ah, damn! Damn, damn, damn! You see, it's going that way. Huh? Snapped off! Ah, shit! Ah! You swivel back? No? The line, the line, the whole thing. Oh, bro, well, hey, you got to fight it at night? <laughs> oh, bro. Oh. Yeah, that wasn't, that wasn't a fish. Yeah, yeah oh, you oh. bird, bro. Oh, <laughs> oh, <quick one>. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, bro, the birds. A few minutes later. Come on now. I'll fuck around here. Yeah. Oh. It. Bro, it's the beef stick tonight, bro. Oh, on, on. Bro, let's go. Drop it. Drop it. <laughs> Set it. Yes, sir. Fish on. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Oh, okay, okay. Tighten that drag. Not, not too much, bro. We don't want to break it off. Crossing over my line. Nenui again, bro. Oh, it's on Dozer, bro. Freaking GoPro battery died again. I hate you, GoPro batteries. Anyway, brother got his catch. Here it is. A little longer than a few minutes later. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Right there. Dip, bro. Just take the fuck out of the thing, bro. Let's go. Let's go, bro. That's it. Find him with the bell on. He's on. 
Yes! <laughs> yeah, let's go, bro. Let's go, let's go. Oh, number four. Count on one, two, three, four. Oh, you see those spots? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Check this out. Fish droppers turn for eat some sand. Chee oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you got <laughs> brother got blasted like I <laughs> you see all the, all the scrap though. <laughs> Ooh, bro. Okay bro. Think. <laughs> Number four, those are on the mic, bro. Okay, come on. Watch out, man. He gets, bro. He spikes his guy. He's a fighter, bro. He's right. He's right, bro. Yes. Hey, yo. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Oh. oh, fish dropper. <laughs> Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. <laughs> yeah. Yes, bro. Okay, bro. It's a. It's the. It's the fucking beef stick tonight, bro. Fucking beefy. Twelve o'clock midnight. Oh yeah. Here you go. <laughs> what the fuck? So he's on, he's on. There you go. Sick, bro. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Right before this strike, I was telling Fish Dropper, if we don't get any bites by 12 midnight, let's pack it up. Uh, oh, what is that? Vicky! Oh, yeah, saw! Oh, that was a danger, though! Bro, hell yeah! Oh, hell yeah! Bro, that's one. Bro, look at the size of the eyes on that boy. Oh man! <laughs> okay, bro. I guess not now. Yeah, you can join your friends in there. Oh yes! Oh, ping! You want to leave at twelve? Okay, bro. <laughs> what the hell, bro? That's funny, bro. If we don't catch anything, bro, by, <laughs> by 12, let's pack it up. And then fuck up and fight. Right bro. there, bro. Holy sheesh, bro. That's a big one, bro. I haven't seen a big one like that in a long time. Bro. That's what she said. Okay. Okay, I guess, I guess we're going to run them till 1230, bro. Oh, shoot. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. If you can grab no phone. Oh, country comfort, beautiful. Oh, yeah. Oh, bro, look at the size of this bad boy. Okay, Hawaiian. Whew. All right, bro. Thank you, sir. Yes, that's a nice fish. That's a big one. Yeah. Don't worry, not gonna say it. Oh, that's okay. This is catching cook time, bro. I'm gonna fucking. I'm gonna fucking run. No, bro. No, no, no. No sashimi for this boy, bro. This is the kind. This, this might be the um the fucking uh, popolati special, bro. Throw them in a microwave. Microwave them for like. Microwave them for like two minutes, and then you boil the oil with the fucking garlic and the fucking green onion, oh. and you. Can pour them right over it, bro. Oh, oh bro, that, that's sticking my mouth water. That was.
Impopulated special, ba? Oh, okay. Shit. <laughs> go check them, go. Go check them, go. Oh, bro, needed that. Okay, ba. Oh, you mother flower. Picture with the beer can for size comparison. Okay, um, <coughs> I think there was a 20 ounce tall can beer. Just kidding, but goes big though. Yeah. Alright, brother. Time to put you out. Okay, thank you, brother. You're gonna fucking. Uh, you're gonna do good feeding the family. There, him. Okay, Hoyne. Ah, you go, bro. Push you off. I always try to dispatch the fish quick so they don't suffer. Oh, f I brought the damn shrimp chips. Where did. Wait a minute, where the f was? Oh my god. I, did, I just noticed it. Oh yeah. It's our destiny to set the water Turn the lights down low. Okay, but see the fucking moon right there. Action all night. Cool, Pretty much. Oh yeah, where we stay? Oh. <laughs> of course, smoke. <laughs> so, brother man, fish dropper. Caught about four or five Ninuis and a top, a dozer top. And uh, okay, he had several bites. Well, if he didn't freaking fiddle faddle around with you, probably would have had some more. Okay, it's fucking birds, man. So, full moon, bro. But it is. That was good fun now time for a little bonus fish cam footage all right so this fish cam footage is not from the same day obviously we was night fishing in that video this was right around the same week or week and a half of fishing um i think we were out somewhere between Kaava and Punalu for this session and I don't know where the rest of the video I get so much footage and I get so much content that I gotta get out to you guys that I kind of keep track already I start losing all these video files all in my computer and my hard drives so you know what I just found this section over here just to throw it out for all you fish cam junkies hope you guys enjoy You know, my guy, Hungry Fisherman, calls the Humus Guardians of the Reef. You know what I call them? I call them the freaking stealers of my bait. That's what the hell I call them. You know, and this is kind of exactly why I've resorted to the three hook T knot rigs because, I mean, all it takes is one Humu for come up and rip your bait and then pow. I mean, seeing how quick these guys went bounce up after that line went sink to the bottom. They, they are right there. I mean, look at these guys. They're tearing at it, tearing at it. Um, you know, what can I say? Look at his brother. He just, bro, he's playing with that damn thing, bro. Come on. Okay, slowed it down, zoomed in so you can see exactly the way they work that bait. And try to work around your hook. Now see, if I went set the hook right here, boom, this brother is hooked. I'm bringing him in. Yeah, I get one small kind fight, throw him back, all good. Or maybe I keep him and eat him and that's one less bait stealer in the ocean. I want to take this time to give a shout out to two brothers who responded to my question on how do they hook up eels when they fish for Ulua and that would be brother Talon Tengen 
5408 and also Hawaii Fishing Maui. Mahalos guys for replying. And hey, you know what? I'm gonna try that next time I hook on Puhi. And you know what? That's probably gonna be real soon because you know I always hook Puhi. Just call me Puhi Slayer already. Okay, back to the action. Here we go. Check this out. Five humus, ba. Five humus hovering around my bait over here. And they still don't can. You see, this is why I wrap my baits. Now that bait is wrapped. If the bugger wasn't wrapped, the baits would be all gone already. So this is real important because I get one vid coming out. You guys gonna trip. I get one vid coming out. Probably gonna create one shot reel first and send it out. But you'll see what happens when you wrap bait. Bro, these humus is just savage, bro. <laughs> and here we go, this puppy over here circling around. And you know, one thing I notice about the papillos, um, especially when, you know, oh, okay, here we go, Kupopo. Okay, I'll finish that papillo thought, but here we slowed it down. Kupopo comes right in, and I get that, that top bait that's right by the cam. Brother doesn't care about the cam, he just comes in, look him, bites it, bites it bites it right there bang you see that right there if i would set the hook bang kupopo is hooked and sensei is telling me that plenty guys eat kupopo and i think tastes good now there you go you guys are gonna shout out anybody eat kupopo let me know and then hopefully i'll remember right away and i'll give you guys one shout out in the next vid let me know how you guys do kupopo when you guys cook them Look at this again, bro. This brother, he knows the hook is there, bro. It's, uh, it's, he's hooked right here. Hanapa is hooked, and I don't know why I not. I never grabbed the pole and set him. You think after, especially watching this last vid, right here, right here, the thing stay in his mouth. You would think that I would set the hook on this guy, but no. And watch him. He just kind of like, like on two pick, bro. The brother is playing with it in his mouth. Yeah, fish drop a small kind hypocritical of me not for set the hook on this guy, but I don't think his tugs was as violent as the Nenui tugs that night. Okay, right here, slow it down for you. Brother is trying for buckaloos and Garins. My bell is ringing right here, Garins. And look, boom, boss is off. Moana comes in. Ooh, I would like that Moana for get hooked up for sure, but either one, I'll take either one at this point. Bang, brother comes in, yanks it, that bottom one, boom, one the twin humus, activate. So much action over here, and I really don't know where the hell I was, I had to be honest with you. I don't know if I was trying for dig in for a bill on White Claw or something. I'm not sure, maybe my bill wasn't on the pole at this point, but... I mean get all this stuff going on and granted these guys is not you know like dozer size fish but you know we just going small to medium gain so right here you know we're not using heavy ulua poles so the bell should be ringing right now this Kupopo grabs it with just a little bit of bait that's held on by the magic string. While we watch this Kupopo see if he can clean out the rest of my hooks, I'd like to send a couple shout outs. Uh, first shout out goes to a brother who left a nice comment. Brother is driving truck in a mainland and you know what but I'm just gonna call you Brother D because I don't like butcher your name but Brother D just sent one nice comment and um you know that's a big reason why i continue to do these vids is because i get choke comments from brothers like you brother d that's in the mainland who comment how much they love the videos and that it kind of reminds them of home so to you brother d big mahalos and speaking of brothers who got stuck in the mainland my last shout out goes to Shane B6830. Shane B6830, ah, you found my videos. And just cause you live mainland, don't blow up the spot in the comments. Come on, Beanie Boy. 
Baba Shane is a childhood friend. We went to school together from grade school all the way through high school. We watched this cool popo still ripping at my hooks here. But yeah, getting back to Baba Shane. We played football together. We boogie ball together. All that kind of good stuff. And uh, I hope you're doing good up there, my brother. Hit me up when you come back. No, I don't take I got no love for the fakeness. If you want to play tough and want to hate this, I'll always show up and make a statement. I don't ever slow up. No, I don't take shit. I got no love for the fakeness. If you want to play tough and want to hate this, I'll always show up. Okay, time to switch up the music here a little bit. We're going to go from Angry White Boy Rap to Chill White Boy Ponderosa Pines guitar music. Hope you guys enjoy. Okay, there's a papilla there in the background. So finishing that. Oh, look at that Moana. Just came up and... Freaking, anyway, sorry. <laughs> I get easily distracted if you can't tell. Um, finishing that thought on the papilla thing that I was mentioning earlier is... One thing I notice about papillas is that when there are other, you know, bait stealers around... And, wow, this Moana is just driving me nuts over here. This, I get one bait that's right there. You can see one T knot right there in front of the camera. And so the Moana is trying to crash that bait that we cannot see on the thing. But <sighs> sorry, if I can get my thought out. Papils, what I notice in a lot of videos is that they are like, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, they're not, they, they just kind of hang out in the background. They wait for the other fish to go and tag first before they, they bounce in. And try get the bait so if you get hummus if you get like this kupopo even these um uh hinaleas over here the, the papil just kind of just lurks and waits and it tries to clean up the scraps and stuff i mean unless they're really hungry then they might come in but they they um yeah most of the times they just take on back seat to these other fish bro unreal and they're bigger you know what i mean they're bigger than these other fish so you know as the saying goes big for nothing oh you seen that Vecchi over there and okay guys you see how long this bait has lasted in the water this is going on at least i don't know half hour maybe wrap your bait guys that's all i can say wrap them Okay, sound like the music went change over here to Yellowstone music. But anyway, um one more shout out guys to War DNA music. I was calling them word now music, but it's War DNA. That's brother Andrew Dam in Maui. And his brother said brother sent me over some new tracks. So be looking forward to listening to that and popping them in some of the upcoming vids. Mahalo's my brothers. Meanwhile, back in the water, look like we get, I mean, these guys is like borderline veke, you know, like big wamas or, or small vekes over here. They just try to clean up the scraps. I still have bait. You can see the bait right there. And uh, these brothers is just tagging them. So I was hoping for the kind. I was hoping for see some oil in this area. But never see any on the fish cam, not on this day. Oh, when big Lohulu comes in, kind of checks it out and he bounces. Lead was stuck and a bugger just in snap. 
So, anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Yeah, I, I hope that, you know, the lighting and stuff was good enough. You know, it's kind of hot nighttime. What I did notice, that one was on full moon. And we seem to get more action. The fish are more active, it seems like, when get at least three quarter to full moon. And that's just my observation. I mean, you know, everybody get their own different experiences. Could be the tide. It could be a multitude of factors. One of the factors of which is actually, to me, is the spot. If you get your line in the right spot, you're going to hunt a power plenty. And as you guys can see, I started fast and I ended fast. But in between, it was all fish dropper. So what can I say? Night of the Nenui. Also, another thing, I didn't know that Nenui's was like really hardcore nocturnal feeders. That's kind of interesting. No way Rhino Hammer shot off this week. I guess all the boys was just doing nothing like me. So I never, nobody had any Hana pounds. So yeah, guys, look. If you guys want to get up on this screen over here, you guys want to flex with your catch, send them to hawaiirhino at gmail.com. If it's easier, you guys can send your pics, which, which I know you guys already post up on Instagram. Send them to hawaiirhino underscore fishing on Insta. Send them to me and we'll get you up and you can be Hawaii Rhino Samas next week. Alright guys, until then, take care of yourself, take care of your Hana. Aloha. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day.